Hello everyone, I wanted to do a uh, quick review. I just came uh, from watching a, the new Fast 9 movie. Um, okay, first and foremost, I have to say one thing. The, um, the Fast and Furious movies, as with, you know, its predecessors after Fast, Fast, uh, Fast 5, I think after Fast 5, they started getting a little bit more action-packed, I would say, for for lack of a better way of putting it. But anyways, you have to suspend your disbelief if you're gonna watch, if, if you're gonna wanna have have fun with this movie. Because as I learned from the previous movie that, I've, well, the first time watching the, the previous movie, um, I, I, I didn't like it. But then I was like, well, you know what? This movie isn't meant to be taken serious. It doesn't wanna take itself serious. Uh, it just wants to uh, take you on a jo on a ride, and that's what it did. Um, so, uh, second time watching the the Fa Fast and Furious Eight movie, and I sh and I told myself I was like, okay, fine, um, I'm just gonna shut my mind off. I'm just gonna enjoy the movie, and I did. So, just letting y'all know, if you wanna enjoy Fast Nine, you you better just suspend your disbelief because you know what. That's what movies really, well, most of them. That's what most of them should be about. Suspending your disbelief and just let, uh, enjoying a film for the sake of having fun with a film. So, um, there's a lot of things that I like. There's a lot of things that I didn't like. But as I said, it's, it's going to be a quick review. So, the things that I didn't like were some of the pacing issues that, that I had. the uh, And then some of the things that weren't necessary for the story um it just took it, it, it could have i could have done without it so and it just added to uh too much to uh too much that was unnecessary for the film so that uh there was uh let's see what else oh yeah i gotta mention this because uh that uh this really this really cool scene took me by surprise no spoilers but there was a cool explosion that took place in the distance and I gotta give it to the sound department because they did a magnificent job. I love it when sound engineers uh, have, they, they, they took the realism of what an explosion sounds like in the distance and they went with it. Uh, some, um, some sound engineers will just have uh, fun, um, well, some sound engineers will just, um, go with the creative side for the sake of uh or for the sake of art and make it sound cool or you know more you know more um more action-packed I, I guess is it just a way of saying it but anyways the uh, there was that, that scene that there was some explosions heard in the distance and the way it sounded is exactly how it how, ex how exactly how it sounds in real life because I've heard explosions in the distance and that is exactly how they sounded like so anyways uh, that uh, I'm gonna give the movie a uh, I'm gonna give it a 7 out of 10 it's a fun film shut your mind off have fun and and you'll like it but anyways that's a quick review of fast 9 it was uh, it was fun Fun, 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 fun. I, I do recommend you watch that movie. Anyways, I'm out of here. Um, I'm driving and it's not safe to use the phone and drive at the same time. Even though I'm doing it, I'm not looking at the phone as I'm talking. So just letting you all know. Um, uh, yeah, that's it. Bye.